yes, I'm back. So today on Chili's Mental Wealth, I am going to be turning into Gamora. I actually attempted this last Saturday. I bleach, dyed, and painted my whole self green. I'm gonna insert a picture here. I went to the Escape to Wonderland Brave, and I tried to film it, but honestly, I just filmed me dyeing my hair, and it was really difficult. I'm a It came out okay it's kind of growing on me the only thing that I just don't like is the fact that I re I didn't really do my roots because I didn't want to have a red scalp during the actual event I was trying to do everything so fast I was really surprised that I literally dyed my hair dyed it bleached it dyed it and did my Gamora makeup and we were out of the door by like 3 30 even though we were like an hour and a half late but I'm doing this again for actual Halloween so that people can learn how to do the Gamora look and, and learn how to do it the way I did it because I actually combined two looks and I'm gonna be fixing things that I think I did wrong. One thing that I do recommend is do not get rid of your eyebrows. What I did is I tried to trim them. It works really well when you're trying to, you know, do your eyebrows the regular way, but because you need the length in order for it to stay flat, when you apply the green makeup, if it's too short, it just starts to like, just ding. And as much makeup that you try to apply and as much glue that I try to apply, it just was not staying down. By the time that I was already putting the green paint, it was too late for me to put more glue. So that's what's going on. So we're gonna start doing that. So we're gonna see. <laughs> I am gonna learn from my mistakes that I did the first time around. And hopefully this time it's gonna be a little bit more easier. And I'm not gonna be wasting my time in doing certain steps that I did last time. So first things first, it's going to be hiding your eyebrows. So I basically just used a regular glue and this is my son's glue. So let's do this. I don't know what that noise is, but it's freaking me out. All right, so right now I'm actually doing eyebrow outline. And like I said, it's not hard for me to do the outlines for some reason. I just wing it. This is like gross right here. This is what's supposed to make your thing tight. This is what you put in your face. <laughs> Pause. We back in action. So I feel like it's more even. <laughs> and I already did the eyebrows. And what she does here is like what I noticed, the thing right here, what she has is like this little thing right here, this scar of her eyebrow. And it looks like this like little, I don't know, it looks like a hook to be honest with you. And then there's something here. All right, so I did the eyebrows. Now the last thing, I'm already running out, so. Good thing this is gonna be the last time I'm gonna do this is this, this, this year. The last thing is you do this thing right here. Like she has this, you know what? I gotta look at a picture. A pause again. I checked and I saw that what you're supposed to do is, oh, I already forgot how it was. It was in my head and I already, I forgot it. I don't have a photo, for photo, photographic memory. <laughs> I don't have that talent. This is as good as it's gonna get. This is as good as it's gonna get. Gamora actually has this thing right here in her eyes. I'm gonna be putting a picture so you can see what it is. She has like these like, it's kind of like antennas and I was only able to do this. I ran out of the, of this. So granted, if you're gonna do this more than once, buy a bigger one. <laughs> This was, I think, like $8. Now I know why, because it was so tiny. So what I was able to do was, I pretty much was able to do everything except the little parts right here, which I'm just gonna add with glitter. No biggie. Now, we're done with the silicone. We're done with the glue. I think now what we're going to do is the green paint now. We need to get to the nitty gritty. I did prime my face. I guess my biggest thing is more about making sure that I just don't know which green to use and I'm gonna end up using a different green this time. I ended up using this one. As you can see, it's, I'm almost done with it. But I have this green and this green, so I'm um, actually, I don't know if I have enough of this. I think I might just still do it and just fuck it. Cause I'm gonna do it different this time. I'm not gonna use water. I'm gonna actually use this and see how it applies. You know, it's, uh, let's see, it's more sure. And that's what I need. The water made it worse in my opinion. Okay, so what I did was that I, I just added a little bit, you know, was just, this is vegan. So I'm gonna see what it's going to. Boop, I did three. And this time around, I'm actually going to use, oh, okay, I like it. Personally, I like the way it smells. <laughs> it smells like suntan lotion to me. Last time, 
I used this brush and I think it took too much of the product that it didn't allow me to play with the paint as much as I wish I could have had or layered it. I just hope that I have enough of the green. I'm more worried about not having enough of the green, but we'll see how it goes. Okay, so this is technically the final look. Now, I did contour a little bit here, contoured a little bit here with the green. So I almost, oh, I almost forgot. I almost forgot my eyeshadow. You just are just gonna add like a dark green and just try to blend as much as you can. Just blend, blend away, blend your little heart out until you feel like there's no harsh lines. All these brushes that I'm using, like I said, they're just really cheap brushes when I do these type of looks because I'm not gonna use my good brushes for stuff like this. So I'm working with what I got. Now, I wanna go just a little bit higher. It's too, it's way too low. And it's not gonna blend, oh. Okay. This is a similar color. It makes it easier to blend. Oh, I have to wait till it dries. So I don't know if that was a good idea because now it's making it hard for me to even blend. Oh my god. What to do? You just gotta make it work. Everything is going fine except for here. <laughs> Who would have thought, Bob? Who would have thought? So I don't know if Gamora wore eyeliner. But I'm going to just do it for the eyelashes. That's all I'm gonna do. Just gonna do it for the eyelashes. I don't know if you can tell the difference, but I really just kind of just briefly did the line so that you don't see the eyelash when I put it on. Yeah, I don't want to do. Or maybe I should do a wing. Hmm? Does Kamara want a wing? I don't have time for a wing. The sun's almost going down. And once the sun goes down, it's on trick or treat. Eyelashes on, B. These are from Ardell. One of my favorite, cost, of, cost effective. Okay, so first eyelashes on. The sucky part is that you can't really see. Mom, look at you, dumb. I gotta clean this up. Do I sing a lot? Do I burp? I do this all the time, even when I'm at home. By myself. Something reminds me of a song. I'm gonna sing along and just belch it out. So now it's time to do my hair. Now the sucky part about having your hair bleached, like the, the, the red's already falling off, is your hair really, really gets damaged. Look okay. <laughs> And it's when you have red hair, it's better that you don't take showers every, week, every day, at least your head, not your body but your, your hair because it'll wash off all the red tint and that's why you have to re-dye your hair. And see, I like the red hair, but I did it so half-assed and because I am somewhat nitpicky when it comes down to my hair, because I'm an ex-hairstylist, I really want to fix it. Like, there's so many missing spots where I didn't do the red in my regular hair that it just really bugs the bejesus out of me. It bugs me and so i'm gonna redo it again like i'm just gonna dye my hair red mostly just do my roots and just add a little bit on the the bottom because it might break or i might do just like semi-permanent because i did buy a semi-permanent one to add on to the red when it starts to wash off the semi-permanent one doesn't have peroxide you don't have to mix peroxide so it's like less damaging for your hair Your hair just falls off and it doesn't grow. <laughs> you know, and I didn't wash it yesterday, so that's why it's still a little cold and it doesn't look as bad, but. I don't think I'm gonna use the eyeliner. The eyeliner was supposed to be for, like, to make these more defined. Maybe I should, I don't know. Will I regret it? I don't know. Should I do it? I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it like that, like, what is? I already have green hairs, do you need to give me more? <laughs> okay, just gonna do that, you know, just, just 
I don't know, dimension, whatever. It's blending in, so it don't matter. Mm, so I just wanna like, I just, honestly I really like this. Like, I think, I think I would like do this a third time. Good. Originally, I got this palette because, I mean it's an alien palette for God's sakes, you know, it's an N69. So, I'm really happy that I was able to support Latina, you know. And uh, yeah, the, uh, actually, sh sh this is the first palette that I actually got, and I got it because of the green. And it worked out the same as James Charles Green. The only reason why I wanted James Charles Green is because he actually had like a darker green, and I was actually planning on returning it. <laughs> As you can see, I got my groove right here. It's really dark already. I went Halloween, trick-or-treating basically on Halloween. Um, I had a lot of fun. A lot of kids really liked my costume. Adults also liked my costume. So it was nice to um, get complicated, complimented because I worked really hard, but hey, it was, it was totally worth it. I was able to turn myself green and finally got to dye my hair red. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> got that off my bucket list. Uh, so, I really, really hope that everybody enjoyed the actual tutorial. I did the best that I could. It was my first one. And, I mean, look at me. Let me just, let me show you. Okay. One last thing is that the second time around came out way better. Totally way better. Even though I struggled a little bit more, it's not as crusty came all clear it's way better I even asked my cousin and she was just like oh yeah it's way better green because mm -hmm. I contoured and I highlighted this time mm -hmm. okay I don't want to wash this out but I have to though <laughs> no more green maybe one day it'll turn green again or something else who would have thought who would have thought I would be feeling myself green I mean who who Feeling this? I'm feeling it. Are you? Because I am. Okay, bye. I really hope everybody enjoyed their Halloween. And if you don't celebrate this holiday, it's all right. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this day to your liking. And I'll talk to you later. Bye. It's green. It's green. Groot, say bye. Bye. Give me a kiss. Okay. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> bye.